Hey everyone, Grayson Knudsen of Eddie's TV here. The first Wednesday of every February is National Signing Day in the NCAA. It's the first day that players can sign with the schools that they verbally committed to, but this makes it official. Think of it as the first day of the transfer window opening or the first day of NHL free agency. This time around, three members of the FC Edmonton Rex girls program have signed with three different schools in the NCAA Division I. After looking through a few schools, I got an email from ULM, University of Louisiana Monroe, which is the school I committed to. Uh, I went on an official visit, and um, the coach really reminded me of my favorite coach here in Edmonton, and uh, the team was really nice and stuff. Brianna started at U10 with the Community League, Kilkenny Community League. Um, she got forced to be a goalkeeper. She bawled her eyes out and did not want to do it and cried and said it was the worst position ever. Um, her coach kind of took her aside, told her she just needed to do what was best for the team and she's never come out of the net. It was a beautiful campus. I loved it and they had an amazing pitch just for the, uh, the girls soccer team. So I can go on at any time of the day and I can just play, which is my favorite part probably about it. And then I can walk out of my dorm and go right to business, which is what I'll be uh, taking there. About, I would say three years ago, she went up for a, head, a header and came down and broke the growth plate in her left ankle. Her physiotherapist told her that if she ever wanted to play soccer again or run again, that she would have to do 100 squats uh, a night, one-legged, while she was in her cast. And, once, and so it was four months. And then when she got out of her cast, she had to run to get her cardio back up. That kid did all that work and found something new in her uh, that all of this work and, and all of this struggle uh, was not for nothing. I was able to kind of spend some time with the girls and give me a little insight as to what university life is like. And I got to see them play and it's a whole different ball game down there. But um, it was absolutely incredible and the academics and everything just sold me on it. I think we've just been, you know, as parents and, and as coaches and as a program, we just try to give them the most opportunity that we can. So, and it's been an amazing journey and she's grown as a person and I'm just really proud. We're all just really proud of, of the people that they become. When I first joined Rex, it was RPC, which was about three years ago, I think. Mm -hmm. And I was the youngest, so like playing with the older players really like put me up there, like put me, like got me better and more prepared for university. I've been in both RPC and Rex now for four years total. And it's just been an unreal experience and it's been awesome and it's given me a great amount of exposure to other schools and specifically Memphis now that I've committed and it's just it's been awesome. My dreams have now been supported by the Rex program, Alberta Soccer, the FAF group, FC Edmonton, all of these programs have con contributed to my basically journey to Louisiana and now I've committed to the McNeese University and I'm so excited. <laughs> the source of joy that comes from them from all of this experience that's, that has been available to them mm -hmm. is just the icing on the cake. And we'd like to congratulate Maya, Brianna and Delena on their commitments and we wish you the very best of luck as your collegiate careers get set to kick off. For Eddie's TV, I'm Grayson Knudsen.